are you still open? I'm going to say yes, yes. Although it sort of depends what you mean by open, because we're not able to see people at the clinic and there's and so non-essential travel so is is not being advised so we are all um around but we're all at home so we're working from home basically so is are you still open yes and so if you answer the phone it gets diverted to the clinic mobile phone which is with nicola if you email we can still see the emails if you um i'm still doing clinics but virtual clinics and answer some of the questions about my virtual clinics so i'm trying to stay as sort of normal as possible but uh clearly it's not a very normal situation and no one's really having business as usual but we're still able to serve and do what we can but in, in terms of actually the end point of doing an operation on someone, that isn't happening at the moment because we've got to distance ourselves socially. So we are still very much open and doing anything we can on a distant basis, which basically means talking to you and giving advice and help and what have you. So if you've got any, I've written to all my patients, if they've got any problems or anything like that, then that's fine. They can email and send photos and what have you. Um, so, and I'm still trying to, as I say, keep clinics going. And I've got uh, oh, some questions about that. So I don't want don't to get, don't want to take away from the other questions. But yeah, I would say that we are still open. Although if you went to the clinic, it's uh, all locked up. So uh, we're not, the, the clinic is not, we're not seeing patients at the clinic at the moment. 